Hey guys, Rico from Arizona Old English Bulldogs here with Coke. Coke is one of our newly acquired uh, AKC English Bulldogs. She's a female, as is her sister Rum, and she is Black Seal. She's more black on her than uh, her sister, which is why we named her Coke, and the other one Rum. But the reason for this video is to do a public announcement of sorts. I've been getting a lot of messages um, through my different social medias, um, coincidentally over the last uh, week from three different people, um, asking about what to do with uh, their puppies having diarrhea. Uh, they're asking about what food to feed and what can they do about this nasty diarrhea. Uh, again, these are not my customers, they're not my clients, my friends, these are strangers who just know me through the social media and they're looking for help. Uh, the public announcement part of it, guys, if you're going to buy from a breeder who's not going to support you, um, don't do it. Don't, don't, don't throw business their way. Um, obviously, um, I'm sure you wouldn't have done it if you knew that they were going to lift you in the lurch and hang it. Uh, but a breeder who's not going to follow up with you, who doesn't care what happens to the puppies, who isn't uh, going to be there to support you and answer questions, uh, is not a good breeder. These are the people that are giving breeders a bad name. So sorry on, on you know their behalf. But to answer your question, uh, you want to stick to grain free whenever possible for all bullies. Doesn't matter if it's a uh, American bully, if it's a uh, you know a American bulldog, a bulldog, an old English bulldog. These guys do best with grain free food. That's my humble and experience um, that that's taught me that grain free food whenever possible. Uh, if you can't give them grain free food, maybe you can't afford it. Maybe you can't find it. Um, look to see that the protein that is in that food is not uh, chicken or primarily chicken because chicken um, they get fed a lot. They fed a lot of grain, so unfortunately that again is going to go into their bodies and it's what causes havoc in their tummies, their skins. You'll see it everywhere. Now, what happens if uh, you switch the food up uh, or you get to switch the food up? And what do you do about this diarrhea? Obviously, tr you know, crate training, house training a puppy is an ordeal in and of its own. Um, adding diarrhea to the mixture does not make it any less or any more fun. So what I recommend is you do this. Got to give them 100% pumpkin. Canned pumpkin works great, guys. Very inexpensive, very easy. Now, listen to me. 100% pumpkin, not pie filling, not the sweet stuff, okay? This right here works wonders. It's a good regulator. It helps them with uh, their stools, whether they be diarrhea or if they're constipated and they're, not, they're having trouble going poop, this will regulate them. Now, this right here is not as efficient as the powder. At least for me, it isn't. If you open up the can, you're not gonna be able to feed uh, that right away, of course, that's just too much for one puppy. It means you gotta store it, refrigerate it, and warm it up the next time. It's a little bit of a hassle. So for that reason, I use the powder variety. You've probably seen this uh, brand before. I use it, Raw Paws. can be found on Amazon uh, and at different other places, but for me, Amazon's the best. Um, they have it at the, the best pricing. And this is what it looks like. It's just pumpkin, 100% pumpkin also, in powder form. They include a scoop, small and a big scoop in there. And you decide, of course, based on your uh, puppy's age or dog size, how much you want to feed them but it has the same effect as the canned pumpkin. That'll be a great regulator for them. It uh, helps their um, tummies to start feeling a lot better and making the, the nice tight ropes that you wanna see. So again, guys, I want to um, let you know that I'm always available to, to help whenever I can. I don't mind answering questions for these folks. Um, for the folks that did answer, I didn't have a chance to answer you individually. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna be truthful. I give priority um, to the folks that you know bought from me or have one of my puppies. Um, I, you know, do this as a, on the side. I, I have a full-time job, and I can't, um, you know, follow up with everybody who asks me questions. But happy to do little videos like this. I hope everybody learns from them, um, and hope everybody does well and that their puppies grow up to be healthy, strong dogs. Um, love them because they love you a lot back. All right, guys, have a great day. Rico again from Arizona Old English Bulldogs. God bless.